Welcome to Auto Bike Focus, your destination for the most detailed stories on vehicles of the past, present, and future, whether they ride on roads or soar through the skies. Today, we examine one of the most ambitious aerospace projects of the modern era, the 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41, a next-generation stealth interceptor that represents Russia's bold attempt to dominate the high-altitude hypersonic battlefield. With speed, stealth, and advanced weapons systems, the MiG-41 aims to redefine aerial combat in the 21st century. The Legacy of the MiG-31 To understand the MiG-41, we must first revisit its predecessor, the legendary MiG-31 Foxhound. Introduced during the Cold War, the MiG-31 was built as a high-speed interceptor capable of patrolling Russia's vast airspace, countering bombers, and tracking multiple targets with advanced radar. However, by the 2020s, the Foxhound was showing its age, even after modernization programs. Russian defense planners recognized the need for a new platform, something faster, stealthier, and capable of countering emerging threats like hypersonic missiles, space-based weapons, and next-generation stealth aircraft. The MiG-41 was conceived as a direct successor maintaining the Foxhound's long-range interception mission while introducing radical leaps in speed, stealth, and armament. Development of the MiG-41 The MiG-41, known internally as PKDP, Prospective Aviation Complex for Long-Range Interception, was first hinted at in the mid-2010s. By the early 2020s, Russia confirmed that the project had moved into active development. The target was ambitious, create an aircraft capable of Mach 4-5 speeds, stealth capabilities, and even near-space operation. By 2026, prototypes of the MiG-41 had reportedly completed initial test flights, signaling that the program was advancing despite economic challenges and geopolitical pressures. The aircraft is expected to serve as a deterrent and high-speed guardian of Russian airspace able to intercept threats at altitudes and speeds most fighters cannot reach. Design and Aerodynamics The MiG-41 departs from the traditional interceptor look of the MiG-31. Its design embraces stealth shaping, with sharp angles, blended fuselage lines, and radar-absorbing materials. Unlike the large intakes of the Foxhound, the MiG-41 uses variable geometry air inlets designed to handle hypersonic airflow. Its long fuselage and delta-like wing surfaces suggest optimization for high-speed flight and high-altitude performance. Engineers have likely employed advanced composites and titanium alloys to withstand the immense heat generated at Mach 4 and above. The design must balance stealth with thermal management, as extreme speed creates plasma trails that can make hypersonic aircraft more visible to sensors. Power Plant and Propulsion one of the most ambitious aspects of the MiG-41 is its propulsion system. Traditional turbofan engines cannot sustain Mach 4-5 speeds. Reports suggest that the MiG-41 may use a combined cycle propulsion system, possibly merging a turbojet slash turbofan with a ramjet or scramjet. This hybrid engine setup would allow the aircraft to take off conventionally, accelerate to supersonic speeds, and then transition into hypersonic flight. Such technology would make the MiG-41 one of the fastest operational aircraft in history, rivaling or even surpassing experimental American projects like the SR-72. Stealth and Survivability At hypersonic speeds, stealth becomes both more important and more challenging. The MiG-41 is expected to feature advanced radar-absorbing coatings, edge alignment, and internal weapons bays. However, its greatest survivability feature may simply be its speed and altitude. Few weapons today can effectively engage a target moving at Mach 4 at stratospheric heights. Additionally, Russian sources claim the MiG-41 could feature anti-satellite capabilities, allowing it to engage orbital assets with specialized weapons. If true, this would mark the aircraft not just as an interceptor, but as part of Russia's space warfare doctrine. Cockpit and Avionics Inside, the MiG-41 is expected to house cutting-edge avionics and digital systems. 
a fully glass cockpit with augmented reality displays, helmet-mounted targeting, and AI-assisted flight controls would be standard. Given the high speeds involved, the pilot's workload would be immense, requiring automation to manage navigation, targeting, and system monitoring. The aircraft would likely feature advanced sensor fusion, combining radar, infrared, and electronic warfare data into a single picture. Its radar system is rumored to be capable of detecting stealth aircraft and hypersonic missiles, giving it a unique edge in modern combat. Weapon Systems The MiG-41 is designed as an interceptor, meaning its arsenal focuses on long-range air-to-air engagement. Its primary weapons are believed to include K-77M and R-37M long-range missiles capable of engaging targets over 300 kilometers away. Hypersonic missiles, possibly in development, designed to intercept high-speed threats. Directed energy weapons, such as high-power lasers, rumored to be under testing for missile interception. All weapons would be carried internally to preserve stealth and reduce drag. The MiG-41's ability to carry space intercept weapons could redefine the balance of power in near-Earth combat scenarios. Role and Mission Profile Unlike multi-role fighters such as the Su-57 or F-35, the MiG-41 is envisioned as a specialized interceptor. Its primary mission is to protect Russian airspace from strategic threats, long-range bombers, reconnaissance aircraft, ballistic missiles, and potentially even satellites. It is not designed for dogfights or close air support, but for long-range, high-speed interception. In many ways, it is less of a traditional fighter and more of a hypersonic guardian, patrolling at speeds and altitudes few others can match. Comparison with global rivals. Globally, the MiG-41 has no direct rival. The closest Western projects are the rumored SR-72 hypersonic drone from the United States and advanced missile defense interceptors, while aircraft like the F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning II dominate air superiority. None are built for Mach 4 Plus interception. If Russia succeeds in deploying the MiG-41, it could create a strategic niche, giving it the ability to neutralize incoming threats before they reach Russian territory. However, the program faces skepticism due to high costs, technological challenges, and Russia's economic limitations. Challenges and Criticism Developing a hypersonic stealth interceptor is no small task. Challenges include Extreme heat management at Mach 4, 5 speeds Engine reliability when transitioning from turbofan to ramjet operation Pilot survivability in high G, high altitude scenarios Astronomical costs in research, development, and production Critics argue that the MiG-41 may remain more of a prestige project than a mass-produced weapon. With Russia's resources stretched, some question whether the MiG-41 can move beyond limited prototypes. Strategic Impact Despite doubts, the symbolic value of the MiG-41 is immense. For Russia, it represents not just a new fighter but a demonstration of technological ambition and national pride. If successful, the MiG-41 could shift the balance of air defense strategy, forcing other nations to accelerate their own hypersonic and space combat programs. Future Outlook By 2026, the MiG-41 is still emerging, with reports of initial flight testing and prototype development. If it enters service by the early 2030s, it could remain in operation well into the mid-21 Saint century. Its existence highlights a new phase in aerial warfare where speed, altitude, and space access are just as important as stealth and maneuver.